Now, viewers, in this module, we are going to discuss our first question. Write the expressions for the following statements in algebraic expressions. So, we have to write it. It is in the format of expressions. So, what is the first one is? So, what is the first one? Q is multiplied by 5. That is, Q multiplied by 5. That is, 5Q. Our next one, second one is, Y is divided by 4 y is divided by 4 that is y divided by 4 you can write like this also then our third one is what is that one fourth of the product of numbers p and q so while writing expression from last you should come so from last from right side you have to come in this direction so product of numbers p and q is p into q that is one fourth of the product one fourth means it is multiplied by 1 by 4 that is 1 by 4 of product of pq that is pq by 4 like this also you can write one fourth of the product next our fourth one is 5 is added to the 3 times of z so what is that 3 times of z times means multiplication 3 times of z 5 is added to 3 times of z that is 5 plus 3z you can write like this also then fifth one 9 times of n is added to 10 so 10 9 times of added to 10 so 9 times means that is 9 into n is added to 10 that is 9n 9n plus 10 or 10 plus 9 9n you can write like that also 9 times of n is added to 10, that is 9n plus 10 or 10 plus 9n, whatever it is. Then 16 is subtracted from 2 times of y. So 2 times of y means 2 into y, then 16 is subtracted from this, that is 2y minus 16. Then our seventh one is 2 times of y is subtracted from 2 times of 16 is subtracted from 2 times of y. Then y is multiplied by 10 and then x is added to the product so what is the product here is so y is multiplied by 10 then x is added to the this product that is 10y plus x 10y plus x like this we need to write the given expressions so in this question we need to discuss that second question write two statements each for the following expressions so y minus 11 so our first expression is normally you can write like 11 subtracted from y 11 is subtracted subtracted from y or you can write like 11 reduced by sorry y is reduced by 11 reduced by 11 or y is subtracted by 11 you can write like that then our second one is you can write another format as Rahul has Rahul has 11 marks 11 marks less than less than what Rajesh had what Raviraj had so here Ravira's marks will be like y. That is the expression. Then our second one is 10 a. First one is a is multiplied by 10. A is multiplied by multiplied by 10. Or you can write like 10 times of a. 10 times 10 times of a times means multiplication the next one what you can write here is guru has guru has 10 times money than guru has 10 times money than what pavan has 10 times money than what pavan had like that here pavan has a a amount of money 
then our next one is x by y so x is divided by 5 x is divided by 5 or you can take it as this one is 1 fifth of 1 fifth of x or 1 by times of x you can take like 1 by times of x you can take like this also then our next one is what you can write here is Purna has 1 by 5th of 1 by 5th bananas bananas Purna has 1 by 5th bananas then what Vimal has so Vimal has in, so he have x number of bananas. Puna has 1 by 5th of bananas then what Vimal has? So our fourth one is 3m plus 11. So fourth one is 3m plus 11. So you can write first statement is 11 is added to 11 is added to 3 times of m or 3 is multiplied 3 is multiplied by m and added to 11 you can write like this also our second one is Lalit has Lalit has 11 more apples more apples than three times of what Rithik has what Rithik has that is Rithik is having m number of apples then our last one is fifth one is 2y minus 5 first one what you can take it is here is so 5 is subtracted so 5 is subtracted from 2 times of y 5 is subtracted from 2 times of y or you can write like 2 times of y is reduced by 5 second one what you can take it here is pawan has 5 rupees less than pawan has 5 rupees less than less than 2 times of 2 times of what Guru has. So here Guru has Y rupees. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. So our third question is Peter has P number of balls and number of balls with David is 3 times of 3 times the balls with Peter. Write this as an expression. So let so number of balls with Peter's number of balls with Peter will be equal to they only given P next number of balls with number of balls with David will be equal to 3 times of number of balls with Peter so that is 3 into number of balls with Peter is P that is 3P so let's take number of balls with David will be capital N then N will be equal to 3P like that we can write this an expression or you can write like our next one is Sita has 3 
more notebooks than Gita. Find the number of books that Sita has. Use any letter for the books that Gita has. Let number of books with Gita will be equal to X. Then number of books with Sita is number of books with Sita will be equal to 3 more books than Gita. 3 more books more books than Gita. So here more means addition. More means addition. That is 3 plus number of books with Gita is x. That is x plus 3. Like this also we can do. Our next one is Cadets are marching in a parade. There are 5 cadets in each row. So here 5 cadets. So number of rows will be here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 5 cadets in each row. This is cadet, cadets. What is the rule for the number of cadets? For a given number of rows. Use n for the number of rows. So here n number of rows. So dot 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 n number of rows are there. So what is the rule for this? So here if you add 5, 5, 5 like this means it will go into multiply. So first row 5 cadets. Then second row from first to 1 to 2 10. Then 1 to 3 15. So here 5 is multiplied with number of rows. So 5 is multiplied with number of rows like that it will goes so number of rows will be equal to n then number of cadets number of cadets in each row will be equal to number of cadets in each row will be equal to 5 then number of cadets in the parade in a parade will be equal to 5 into n. This is our expression. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.